Welcome to South Street Loves, a feature on one of Philadelphia's most historic neighborhoods, the South Street Headhouse District. This district has more independently owned bookstores than any neighborhood in Philadelphia, so it's clear that South Street loves books. First off, we've got Headhouse Books, located at 2nd and South. Headhouse Books has been on 2nd Street since 2005 and features not only a great selection of books, but also a variety of unique toys, cards, and gifts, some of which are made by local artists. The titles in Headhouse Books represent a selection curated to fit the tastes of the neighborhood, and being locally owned means big name publishers can't buy space in the store. They've got an expansive children's section, which also features an area where children can play with some of the toys while their parents shop. Headhouse Books' motto is independent and local, like you, and it shows in some of the services they offer the neighborhood, such as complimentary gift wrapping and delivery. You can even special order virtually any book in store or online and have it delivered around the neighborhood. And they work with nonprofits around the city to provide used soft cover books to prisons. They have several events in the shop every month, from lectures to book signings, and the schedule can be found on their website. Be sure to check out Headhouse Books, open every day at 11. Next up is Garland of Letters, located between 6th and 7th on South. Garland of Letters is a bookstore that's been open since 1972 and focuses on self-discovery with a large section on Eastern philosophy. Don't let the term bookstore fool you though, because the shop also features a wide selection of specialty incense, handmade jewelry, and even yoga accessories. In fact, when the store opened over 30 years ago, it was primarily a studio for yoga and qi gong, and has evolved into a one-stop shop for many health and wellness philosophies. Garland of Letters features a wide selection of accessories for self-discovery and relaxation, like handmade Tibetan tonkas, which are ornate representations of Eastern deities. They also have instructional DVDs for meditation and other philosophies, as well as a huge collection of crystals and ornate stones. When you stop into the shop, be sure to check out the handmade wire-wrapped pendants made by a local Philadelphia artist. Garland of Letters is open at noon every day and opens an hour early on Saturdays. Down the road is Brickbat Books, located on 4th between Bainbridge and Monroe. Brickbat Books is a shop that has a curated selection of new, used, and rare books. They've been on 4th Street for over 5 years and focus on literary fiction and collections of poetry, art, and photography. All of the shelving has been hand-built by the owner and stocks anything that will catch the interest of book readers. From unique editions to collectible graphic novels, Brickbat Books even has some copies that are over 100 years old, like this 1839 copy of Pride and Prejudice. They also have a selection of records and feature bands that have come to perform at the shop, sometimes from as far away as Japan. Between the concerts and lectures, Brickbat features live art three to four times a month, and you can find a complete list of events online. They also do special orders for harder to find books and records, and be sure to check out the display case behind the counter, featuring incredibly rare books with several signed by their respective authors. Open every day at 11, Brickbat Books is a truly unique place to shop. Last but not least, we've got Wooden Shoe Books, located at 7th and South. Wooden Shoe is a nonprofit volunteer run bookstore that's been in the neighborhood since 1976. They specialize in books relating to philosophy, political theory, feminism, and social change. In addition to books, Wooden Shoe also has patches, t-shirts, and posters. The shop is an anarchist collective, which means all employees are volunteers trying to provide an information sharing and educational space. Wooden Shoe has Philadelphia's largest collection of zines, self-published magazines from around the world, some of which have been circulating since the early 80s. The shop has events almost every night, from readings to movie showings, and information about times can be found on the website. You can find a huge selection of free publications at Wooden Shoe as well, from local newspapers to national zines. Wooden Shoe is open every day from noon to 10 and is a great place to find new philosophies or exchange ideas. All right, folks, that's it for South Street Loves Books. Check SouthStreet.com for news or other videos about the neighborhood. And as always, make sure to keep exploring this incredible district.